and George Howard. How are we doing, mate? Good to see you. Okay, gaming Zoom, training down at Arena Hub Fitness. Um, I've not come across you yet on the show, I don't believe, so uh, give everybody watching back home a little bit of information about yourself and what they can expect come Saturday next week. Uh, so yeah, I'd like to bump into you, but uh, I do get down to uh, Arena as much as I can. Uh, I'm actually originally from, from Newbury, um, from uh, the West Berkshire White Collar Queens. Uh, so now I've been doing training there, training in Arena, and just putting in as much hard work as I can really. And, yeah, try to get that fitness up. So you've had, have you had a fight so far on the White Collar scene? Yeah, I've had one uh, back in October. Uh, lost on um, decision points, whatever you want to call it. Uh, you know, and I've gone away from that and I've tried to work on all my weaknesses that I showed that night. So, okay, they pop up again. So you've been putting the effort in, putting the training in. Have you done anything different this time compared to what you've done on the last time to try and get that big W? Yeah, definitely. Just working on the cardio, you know, because it, it's all well and good. Uh, you know, people try lift weights to look good. It don't mean anything. You get in there, your adrenaline hits. You get to start by the end of the first round. So you need to build up your, uh, your endurance, get those lungs open. Maybe like that's how that is. And are you uh, are you going in there for three solid rounds of boxing, or are you going to try in there and uh, you're going to try and drop him? You know, you, you never know what's going to happen. But um, you know, when people do this, I know they train hard. I'm sure he's trained very hard. Uh, so you know, I've got the um, hopefully my lungs are willing to go for the three rounds. You know, I'm not looking for an early stop or anything like that. I'm just going to give it my all and see what happens. George, how are we doing? I've not come across you again, but training down at SMAP, uh, giving everyone a little bit of information about yourself, your training, and what people should expect from you come next Saturday. This will be my first fight. I've been training hard, training a lot. Uh, I know I've got the fitness to go three rounds, if uh, it's out that it comes to, but if not, then I won't turn the finger in. Train hard, uh, it's going to be a good time. George tickets have they been going back yourself and he's still got, still, still got some available and um, on the night when you get in the ring with him, what are people going to expect? Are you going in there to try and do three rounds of boxing or are you going to try and drop him down and uh, make him go away with a big W but with a knockout to the name of yours? You know, I could do both, uh, I think, but um, I'm open to what happens. You know, I've uh, sparred a lot, lots of different things have happened, I've adapted, it's gone smooth, so. Happens. And how long have you been training down at the SMAF and uh, have, you, have you had a fight so far? No. It's my first fight. I've been training at SMAF for eight months. I've known about this for two months and that's when I've really been gearing up and ready for this match. Eight months of training with Jason O'Grady, that's, that's good, you know, that's some people take a fight, they've been training three years but they go once a week. I'm sure Jason wouldn't have put you on the show if you've not been putting in 110% of effort. Yeah, Jason works as hard. So, uh, <laughs> thanks Jason. Tickets to yourself, obviously, you've still got some available, how do people contact you uh, to get them, Jamie? Yeah, I've still got a couple available, uh, ping me a message if you've got my number, or uh, over Facebook, I've um, got a few left, it'll be good uh, to bring as many supporters as possible, uh, obviously being from Newbury, you know, we've got a lot of the Newbury boys coming up anyway, and uh, you know, hopefully we'll put on a show and um, make it worth their while. Jamie, I'm not sure if you've met George before, but this is uh, the face-to-face -face job now, have you got anything you want to say to him? Not really, no. Uh, like I said, glad he been putting in the training and uh, let's hope it pays off and put on a show for people. And good luck on the night, mate. George, would you like to add anything to this? It's been, you know, been so far this evening, been very civilised, everyone's gracefully you know, against each other. And you're going to knock him out. <laughs> <laughs> Likewise, uh, glad to him putting in training. Uh, glad to keep the fight to so, uh, Ladies and gentlemen, two more respectable guys. Let's have a big round of applause for Jamie and John. Face out first, some fellas, please. And then face off. Brilliant. See you next week.